All right, what is up guys? Quarterback HG, I'm back on the video. And today I'm gonna be doing like a story time type video. It's gonna be kind of like a laid back type video. So uh, get your popcorn ready, get some hot chocolate, whatever you want, sit back, relax, you know. It's gonna be a funny, sad, it's not a sad one, but it's like an interesting story time about the time when our team lost because the other team cheated. So like last video, let's try to get this video to 75 likes, possibly. So the story starts off, um, we were, I want to say like five and two, that was our season record going into the playoffs. I was like nine or 10, but um, I was young and I was playing City League. I played for the Wolfpack and we were like a decent team. We weren't like really, really good and we were really, really bad. So if you, can, if you guys can hear people in the background, I apologize for that. But um, So we weren't really, really good, but we weren't really, really bad. We were kind of in the middle. So basically we were going to the playoffs and we beat, I'm pretty sure we beat the, I know we, we beat the Tigers, but I'm not sure if that was our last regular season game or our first playoff game. Um, I'm pretty sure that was the um, last regular season game, but basically going in the playoffs, we thought we were gonna go to the championship. I thought we were gonna go to the championships and we were pretty excited. So we were gonna play the best team in the league, the Redskins. Um, I know a lot of people play on the Redskins and they were our, they were like my rivals because I just knew a lot of people that played, and you know you know what it is when you play people that you know. It's kind of like kind of like a rivalry, but um I didn't like them. Our rival, our formal rivals, a rivalry like the person that we were supposed to be rivals with was the Panthers, but I didn't really have a problem with them because they were really bad and we beat them every time. But at the time, I really did not like the Redskins, so we played them, and um I'm, we were down late. My friend Campbell got a reverse, and he like ran around. It was he, he's super good at reverses, so he got the ball, ran around, and I'm pretty sure he juked some guy and cut inside. I mean, cut back in, outside for a touchdown, and I was so hyped. I like started crying for some reason. I don't know why, but dude, I was so hyped in that moment because I was like a clutch touchdown. We really needed that. So then after that, it went into overtime, right? And we were really really hype, and um, we were just excited. And on our first drive of offense. We got a touchdown. I think we got a touchdown. This is really blurry, really blurry memory, but I'm almost positive we got a touchdown. We got a touchdown, and I think we missed the extra point. I think we did. Not sure, but I'm almost positive we missed the extra point. So coming on defense. So we were on defense. I'm pretty sure I was playing, like, left end or something like that, or, like, defense, defense tackle or linebacker. Not sure. But basically, they handed the ball off. He went right in the middle for some reason. I remember seeing him go in the end zone. So like I'm here and I'm like, he's going, he's in the end zone. He's like right here. So I can see him in the end zone. He was like, it, oh, he was at like the three yard line, by the way, or like the five yard line. So we ran in and we got him on like the two yard line. We tackled him on two line, tardy, two yard line. There was a pile. And all of a sudden he started scurrying across the goal line. I was like, bro, what are you doing? And if you guys know, youth refs are really, really bad. I mean, not all of them, but a lot of them are really, not really bad, but they're pretty bad. And they hadn't seen it because there was a pile, right? So they come over, see the ball across the plane, and they count it as a touchdown, and they get the extra one to win. But the thing was, he never got a touchdown. He was on, like, the two-yard line, and he started, and then he, like, crawled in, army army crawled in for a touchdown, and we were just so mad. Our coaches saw it. Their coaches saw it. We knew he wasn't in. So he's my brother. He was on the team. Yes, I'm talking. I'm talking about how the Redskins cheated. Oh, dude, that was some bull. It was. All right, so basically, you know, I was already always holding down the edge like I always do. No. And so basically, it was. So they scored on fourth down. Or wait, no, they no, didn't. no, it was fourth down. It was like three or two overtimes. And we had scored, but we missed the two point conversion. See, I knew it. I knew it. Let's get it. And so what they did was. So it was fourth down, and the dude went up the middle, and he was down about the like two yard line, right? No, he was down about a yard. And then okay, once the play was dead, everyone was piling on. He reached his hand over, like no, he blade, crawled like, over. Like he didn't he crawl over, over. He reached his hand over. Or whatever. He did both, but he like blatantly. It was the play was blatantly over. It had been over for a couple of seconds, so it was blatant. But obviously the city league refs are some tra are some trash. Right. So that's what I'm saying. And then I got up in the rest face, and they. Like, hey, 
All right, but then after that, I got a two-point conversion. But it, it didn't really win the game because we could have stopped the two-point conversion. But Wait, if that still, if that didn't. If they were to actually make the right call, then we would have gone to the Super Bowl. Mm -hmm. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe. This video is 75 likes, as I said before. Thank you guys for watching. Quarterback AC signing off. Peace. Peace.